What's up? Not much, guys. You're right. I'm sorry, I got busy. It's okay. You okay, hon? You okay? I'm, I'm perfectly okay. All right, well. I worked 11 hours today. Right. I was driving the truck. Yeah. Wait, did you slid right into you? Yeah, yeah. I just stopped the light. She just slid into me. Okay. Where do you live? Okay. Okay. I'll get your license. Is this your car, man? Sixteen, you wanna come over here? We'll switch. Pineapple. That's fine. Okay. I don't go out at all. Alright. That's fine. The lens is coming over. Alright. Do you have a jacket by chance in your car? In the back seat. Okay. Honestly, where, where are you going to? No, I was trying to go home. To. I'm gonna have another officer come over here in a minute. And we're gonna uh, do a quick test on you, see how you, you know, if you're okay. And then we'll take it from there, okay? I assume it's disabled, but well, yeah, we have to anyway. Cause the airbag went off. I'm sorry. Yes, I got it. Watch your back, uh, Steve. Uh, start one hook for the 
Lincoln for the airbag. Just came out of nowhere, huh? <laughs> we knew it was coming, well, I guess. Yeah, that's fine. I stopped. Otherwise, I, I worked 12 hours in the hospital before he said I got tired. I only came out because it's my grandma's birthday. That's fine. I work in trauma surgery and have replacements and new replacements. When she comes. Switch with her. Uh, you know what? Actually, you stay because I'm my 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 thing's gonna die. So it's probably not gonna work. But yeah, when she comes. Let's try one more time, just because this is my technology. Yeah, my camera's gonna die. So when I'll 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 go deal with the domestic when uh, with Mark. All right. Then Lindsay will uh, I'm a give her a test. Top talk to you. <laughs> Where were you coming from? I was from Tropicana. Tropicana. Okay. Okay. A few more minutes, the other officer will be here. Okay. Obviously, your car is disabled. Okay, so. That's the side you want to take off. Insurance. Well, that's self insured. That's like that's like that's city vehicle. So that's self insured. Just uh, stay here. I'm gonna advise her. Sorry, she's coming from Tropicana. She admitted to having a couple drinks. She's starting to wear a little bit. Okay. Um, um, she okay. ran it to the back of the uh, public works truck. Is this going to be safe to actually do the testing on it? It's slippery. That's my only concern. Uh, I mean, you could do. That's my only concern. I know. Um, you have to form it. Get the key for the. Um, for the car. Community building. I would take her inside. Or you could do it under there, and you got to walk all the way over there, under the uh, under the vestibule there. If you want to do that? Either way, the car is disabled. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. Try to figure it out. I'm gonna have to go inside with Mark. All right. Yeah, mine's probably about to as well. Yeah, I got like. I'm okay. Hi, I'm Officer O'Connell, Thunder State Police Department. Uh, do you have a jacket or anything? Because I'm going to have to do some testing on you to make sure you're okay to be driving. Oh my gosh, of course. Um, we got to find a place where it's not slippery to do this. No, that won't work. I'm thinking. Yeah. <laughs> or right there. I don't know if that's enough space underneath that awning. Kind of I need to just there. level though. That's not me. That's the only problem. O'Connell, you said your last name? Yes. Hi. How are you today? I'm alright, how about you? So you, um, I, you I was at the Tropicana. Okay. I was with my girlfriends. Okay. 
I don't normally go out. I have a brain injury. Okay. I've had a brain injury for it'll be seven years in December. Okay. I've only had three drinks tonight. Okay. Um, it was Jack and Ginger. Um, I came out just for to see a band at the Tropicana. I was driving back okay. when it happened. Okay. And my airbags deployed. Okay. One received. I'm gonna have to because all snow is covered everywhere else. I don't want the test to be compromised. Do you see anywhere over there where it's I can take it by St. James, where it's no snow, see that but it has to be level. Yeah. It's just a. That's just a long walk. I'm not. I'm not up there. What about, go um, by the community building real fast, see if that's long enough for the second test. I can't turn my car on to find my shoes. You don't even have your shoes on. I can't give it to you, but I... I'm so sorry it's to okay. be disturbing your night like this. No, it's all right. Uh, so you gotta make sure you're safe. No, I'm so embarrassed. It's not even funny. Like I literally don't go out. Mm -hmm. I don't do anything. I got gotcha. you. This is my first night out in maybe mm -hmm. like two years. Yeah. And my boyfriend's sober. Mm -hmm. I'm sober. I haven't had a drink in mm -hmm. over two years. Okay. Do you have shoes in your car? Yes. I, I had to, I literally took my shoes off before, like, after I started driving. Okay. I got really turned around. Mm -hmm. I was trying to find Atlantic Ave to get back onto the turnpike. Okay. And I kept, like, doing circles okay. over and over again. And then that's when I saw the, um, the construction car yeah. stop again. And I, I started to slip. Okay. But I do have to do some testing, so I do oh need you gosh. to find your shoes. <laughs> I, I know. I, I, I feel absolutely horrible. One. I, I literally just had both of my shoes. Okay. I think we'll have enough room over there. It's your fault. But we, we will. I think everything fell out. What kind of. So you don't even have shoes? Everything was underneath. I think everything fell out underneath my seat. May I open my door, please? Yeah. One, I'm probably going to have to. She doesn't even have shoes. I was having numbness and tingling in my feet. <laughs> She believes they slid under her seat and she's trying to find the mail. If, uh, We're going to bring her to the PD yeah, and do I'll stand by with yeah. the car. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I've never been so embarrassed in my life. It's okay. Alright, um, so do you have, you do, you do you think you have shoes? Because I have shoes. No, okay. I 100% have so shoes. So I have to, I have to if, if do testing. If you want me to do a test, I will do no, no. test bear for like, No, 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 that, that, that would compromise the test. That's not going to happen. What do your shoes look like? They were tan and open-toed. Tan, open-toed. Um, do you give do you give this officer permission like to check oh the, under your seat? One hundred percent. I'm gonna open this, okay? Just for the yes, sake. Just of to get your shoes. No, that's one hundred percent. So I have a bag here. I don't want. I'm no, move. I. I'm it wasn't so enough. embarrassed. It's not even funny. Like I'm really. Are these your shoes? The the tan, open-toed. Yep. Yes, tan, open-toed shoes. Whatever you find. I found them. They're, oh, they're they were, heels. They were yeah. kind of open. <clears throat> the bag was open, and they were like this. Okay. This is all being recorded. Are these the only shoes we have? I have Converse and Bexy as well. Or, honestly, I don't even know if I got my bag from the room. Is it a purple bag? Mm hmm Yeah, you have it. Okay. Should we look for the sneakers? Give her the bag. Do you want it 
So what you have to do is some testing. Can you do testing in heels? Yes. Or would you rather your Converse's? Let me do the Converse. All right, come out here and grab them. Can you just remind me of your name, please? Officer O'Connell. O'Connell. Yes. Thank you. I really appreciate you guys. I, I'm beyond sorry tonight. Like, I can't express the... Careful. Watch. Yeah. I don't, put, I don't want you to slip. I know. I'm sorry. Are you on the seat enough? Yeah. Can you stay with her? I'm going to pull yeah. up my car. I got you. I... Wanda, 15. She found Converse sneakers, but I'm going to be transporting her to the PD to do the testing. Um, so what we have to do is I have to go take her to the police department to do some testing. So, can't do it here. <laughs> yeah, I, not with this weather. Yeah, we call it a hook. I believe they call it a hook. Uh, he's going to stand by anyway for momentarily. So if you want to reach in and, and get the key for the tow truck. So to get you out of the snow. Did you get your documents, whoever needed, for the accident report? Uh, I got hers on my body cam and I gave it back. Okay, that's fine. Um, as I long as you went. And I read it out loud. Uh, and then you didn't know where anything else was. And Bill took care of the public work stuff. I just called out the driver. That's fine. I'm really sorry to interrupt you, my guy. So what's going to be happening is you're going to be coming with me. I'm going to take you to the police department. We're going to do some testing there. Of course. And depending, uh, we yeah. go from there. Let me get this off. I have my, these gloves that are not taken off. Thank you. You got anything on you that's going to stick or poke me? Yeah. I just got to pat you down oh, real quick. Down. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Just my wallet. Okay. Turn around. I'm not searching you since you're not under arrest at this moment. But you just need to... Okay. You're just doing your job. Uh, motion these cars. Pass me. Hold on one second. I'm gonna, these are your keys. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put them back in your pocket for right now, okay? Thank you. Do you have your phone or any other, um, have, anything you need? you have your phone right now? I, I really honestly don't know where my phone is. You don't even know where your phone no, is? I, I honestly don't care. Okay. All right. <clears throat> Thank you, officer. Mm-hmm. Can have a seat right in here. Thank you. Watch your set. Try to put your seatbelt on you. Thank you so much. I'm really sorry for all this you inconvenience can be sorry. tonight. Oh, this doesn't want to work. There we go. Okay. Yeah, stand by for a moment. What's the percentage chance you'll be needing the ambulance assistance again? Can't give you that. One at District One. I'm going to be transporting this female to one for SVSTs. Starting mileage 13197. Backseat check clear prior. Seat belted in. Not a problem, ma'am. What's your first name? Teresa. Teresa? Teresa, what's your last name? Yeah, that's what you were telling me before.
Just wait until I park because I have to help you out of the car anyway. One at District 1, any mileage, 198, standby for backseat. Oh. Alright. Not a problem. So it is, there's a step right here, so just take your step. All right, and then, yep, come right over here, perfect. Just hang on. It's okay. You're, we gotta just make sure that you're safe to be driving. No, we'll I really go from appreciate there. you but, and what you do for your job. I, I can't tell you enough. Thank you, I appreciate that. Come right over here. Backseat check clear. All right, so you're gonna come with me. We're gonna go right down this ramp, okay? Thank you. Right down here. Let's see. Oh, 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 oh. Don't want you running on me. <laughs> Just have a seat right here. Huh? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna do everything down here. He's still up there. Yeah. Or do you want him to stand by? Did you call a hook for that one? For the walls get damaged anyway. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Cause um, I'm gonna need a battery. I'm at seventeen. So am I. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I don't want it to die on me. Lieutenant, did you call out all her info? I believe Steve Okay. No, I'm just going to make sure we have all of your information. How do you spell your first name? T H E R E S I. Birthday is. Do you have a middle initial for middle name? C for Christine. And what's your address? And a good telephone number for you. Okay. Shutting off for a battery. I've just worked really hard to get to where I am, mm -hmm. and I never thought I'd be the person in my relationship where. Do you want to just do it right here? Good. I would do it. Do it over there. Okay. So what I'm going to have you do yeah. is um, we're I'm going to have you stand up. We're going to come down over here. You can take your jacket off if you want. It's completely up to you. All right. Just come. We're going to come over down over here. You want me to where you? Yep. You're fine right there. I was gonna one additional one. I'm gonna be starting my SFSTs. Okay. <clears throat> so what I'm gonna do is just keep your legs together and your arms down by your side. Okay. I'm gonna redo a couple of different mm -hmm. things. So just listen to what I have. Yeah. All right. Okay. So first, I'm gonna ask you: Do you have any issues with your eyes? No. Besides my brain injury, no. Okay. Um, are you taking any medication for your brain injury? I Okay, and when did you take those medications? This morning um, and at noon. Okay. Um, does your brain injury affect your vision? Yes. Yeah? 
Hmm. How does it affect your vision? At nighttime. But like how? Like um, some blurred vision. Okay. Um, otherwise, like pulsating. But besides that, it's otherwise just blurred vision. Okay, I'll take that into account. Hmm. And are you in any pain right now? No. Okay. No injuries? No. Okay. All right. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to check your eyes. Mm -hmm. Keep your head still and follow the stimulus, which is going to be the tip of this pen here, with your eyes only. Do not move your head. Do you understand the instructions? Yes. Okay. Just look at the tip of the pen, okay? Don't go anywhere else. Hold on, hold on a second. Can you see the tip of the pen? Mm -hmm. Watch on the tip of the pen, okay? Keep following it. Gotta follow the tip of the pen, okay? Mm -hmm. Don't go past it. Keep following the pen. You still see it? Mm hmm? Don't go past it, okay? Just continue watching. Mm -hmm. Okay, continue watching. And again. Do you have anything that affects your balance? Does not my brain injury? No. Okay, but you, does it affect your walking? A little bit. And how does it affect your walking? With my drop foot on my right foot. Okay, uh, I'll take that into account for the test as well. Okay, so what I'm going to have you do is actually um, put your turn around over here. Mm -hmm. Nope, you can just walk over here, but I just want you to face me this way. And we're going to start. And I will explain all the instructions, okay? Mm -hmm. And again, I'm going to ask, are you injured in any way? Mm -hmm. Are you injured in any way? I have drop foot in my right foot. Drop foot in your right foot? Yes. Right okay. Injury. Okay. All right. So I want you to imagine that there's an imaginary line mm -hmm. down this hallway. I want you to put your left... I'm going to explain it and give you demonstrations. Okay. I want you to put your left foot on the line and your right foot in front of it with your right... Sorry. With your right heel touching your left toe, keeping your hands at your side. Mm -hmm. Do not start until I tell you. So that's your... Um, your left foot on the line, your right foot in front of it, with your right heel touching your left toe, mm -hmm. and your hands. Don't start until I tell you. No. Nope. Get get out of that. Sorry. All right. So, like I said, don't do anything until I tell you. All right. So you're gonna put your left foot on the line and your right foot in front of it, with your right heel touching your left toe. Keep your hands by your side. So it looks like this. Don't start until I tell you. Do you understand the instructions? Yes, I understand. All right. You may get into the starting position. Okay. When I tell you to begin, I want you to take nine heel-to-toe steps in the line, turn around, keeping your one foot in the line, and return nine heel-to-toe steps. I'm going to... No, no, don't start. Um, um, so it looks like this. One, two, three. I'm only doing three. You're doing nine. On your ninth step, keep the front foot on the line. I'll go back to the starting position. Go back to your starting position. On the ninth step, keep your front foot on the line and turn by taking several small steps with the other foot. So it looks like this. And then you return. One, two, three. Get back in the starting position. While walking, watch your feet at all times. Keep your arms at your side. Count your steps out loud. Once you begin, do not stop until the test is completed. Do you understand these instructions? Yes, I do. Okay. You may begin. Again, I'm going to ask you, do you have any issues with your balance? 
besides my brain injury, no. Okay. All right, so stand with your heels together, your arms down by your side. Uh, do not begin the test until I tell you. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. When I tell you, I want you to raise one leg, either leg, approximately six inches off the ground, foot pointed out, keep both legs straight, and your eyes on the elevated foot. While holding that position, you're going to count out loud, 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, and so forth until told to stop. So it looks like this. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, and so forth. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. You may begin. Six inches off the ground. You have to be looking at your foot. If that foot doesn't work, you can pick a different one. So, ready? We'll start over. Okay. Ready? Yes. You may begin. Keep going. 1012. Keep going. 1013, 1014, 1014. Okay. 15. You're good. Okay. So what's gonna be happening right now is I am taking you into custody for a drive and while intoxicated. Yes. Okay, you understand? Yes, I understand. I understand. One of district one, the female is gonna be in custody for 450. Okay. So what we're gonna do is come in right in here. <clears throat> You done? Okay. Have a seat right there. Yes. We got some more stuff we have to go over. Okay. Do you live? I. That's a my apartment. Okay. Stand up for me. Uh, you can leave your jacket here. I'm gonna have to. Uh, I'm gonna fully search you in just a oh, moment. Of course. Just have a seat on that bench on that computer yeah, right there. I didn't search her yet, so I'm gonna search her on camera and then I'll do everything else. One. Tell them we're all fair. Yeah. Tell them we're all fair. Yeah. All right, let me just do her search. Teresa, stand up for me for a moment. I just gotta search you real quick because you are under arrest. Yep. You got no bell on, correct? Nope, no sir. Just another one. Get around you real quick. Do you just clip ins? Yep, okay. just clip ins. I, I take Spread your legs for me. For him. Thank you. That's a bell. Okay. All right. Uh, Teresa, have a seat right over here, right over this one. <clears throat> Thank you. Just stay there for just a moment. I just need to get this off. Okay. 